watching Dallas now, they really get up and down the floor, and, and they play um, uh, a pretty open court game. Uh, and I didn't want our guys to get seduced into that, uh, to where they were just running and taking jump shots. You know, we we got kind of caught up in it a couple of times, particularly in the second half. Um, but uh, it was the first half I thought where we really uh, established the tone of the game, established the rhythm of the game. Uh, I thought Josh came out and did a phenomenal job at the very beginning. He and Al. Establishing us defensively, uh, I thought Kyle played uh, played very well. Got some really good minutes out of Deshaun and uh, you know, Devin Harris, and, and, and then our bench guys. I thought you know, you know did a good job. Uh, second quarter, we we had a little bit of a lapse, but uh, we regained our composure um, and executed the plays and, and defensively came up with some stops. Um, but I thought it was a really good test for our guys, particularly playing against a, uh, a Dallas Maverick team that is. Uh, that is well coached, number one and two. Um, you know, they've got some, they got some players over there that, uh, from a matchup standpoint, they can be tough. But uh, I thought our guys took the challenge. I thought they came out and played with a lot of energy, as I said. And uh, uh, we got the lead, and uh, we didn't look back. Can you talk about Mike Scott's game today? He shot the ball extremely well and just really got active on the boards as well. Yeah, Mike is, uh, Mike is getting more and more comfortable with our, with our system. I think he's starting to find his niche uh, within what we do. Pop shooter, uh, and he has a very solid uh, low post game. I thought he came in and gave us some very valuable minutes. I was very happy to see um, at the very beginning that he, you know, he hit the first couple of shots. It seemed like that energized him on the defensive end a little bit, uh, but he had just a solid game, a very, very solid game. We talk a lot about the defense, but, but, it's, but that's from when we get hints of the offense, that's what it is, you know, starting off with two, three pointers and kind of establishing that. Well, yeah, I mean, I, you know, I, I talk a lot about defense, but, um, you know, in some instances, a good defense is a, a solid offense, you know, and uh, I think it's important that we as a team, we, you know, we understand what our strengths and what our weaknesses are. We understand what, uh, um, you know, what's a good shot and what's a bad shot. Um, we play together, you know, we move the ball. We get the ball to guys who are our shooters. Um, we did, uh, I thought we did a good job with that today. Um, Got the ball into the post to you know with Josh and particularly he's at the three we posted him some post Al some um, so I thought we did a good you know did a good job overall offensively I think when uh, when you watch us play um, I think one thing that that uh, you know you could clearly see is uh, how well we move the ball I thought um, you know when we have the ball jumping from one side of the floor to the other particularly when teams are uh, double teaming the post or whether there's a you know they have a breakdown or a dribble penetration. Um, we have shown that we're a very unselfish team when we're basketball, and uh, we've got guys that can make shots. And uh, early in the game, those guys are making shots. Um, you know, is it, that, that's a good sign. So, uh, you know, I'll, I'll continue to harp about the about the defense, but you know, you, you, you're right from an offensive standpoint. Uh, when we're making shots and, and, and when we're executing offensively, um, you know, we become pretty good. Coach, could I have told you before the game that Ivan Johnson had the same amount of points as, points as Lou Williams at the end of the game? One more time. <laughs> the Ivan Johnson and, and Lou Williams will have the same amount of points at the end of the game. Oh, oh. Um, I didn't know that, but, um, you know, I thought Ivan did a really good job tonight. I thought he, um, you know, from a from an offensive standpoint, I thought he played um, uh, with a little bit more poise and under uh, a little bit more control. He was a little better in shot selection. Um, but the thing I was most impressed about Ivan was uh, his defensive effort. I thought he did some phenomenal things. Uh, out there on the floor defensively, uh, particularly, uh, I remember a couple of times where he uh, gave an extra effort in getting out to a perimeter guy and contest the shot. And, uh, and he came from a long way on, on both cases. Uh, and, and those are the type of efforts that we have to have from from, from him and from all of our players. Uh, we call that multiple efforts. You know, where you know there's there's a remote chance that you can get there and block the shot, but uh, they got to see you coming out of the corner because that may, may be enough to, to throw him off. I thought uh, uh, Ivan really uh, exerted a lot of energy tonight uh, defensively and uh, did some really good things. He, I thought he played a pretty solid game. And I know it's just a preseason game, but you were able to trust him with five fouls for a long stretch of the game. I, I know it's preseason, but it's had to say something about him as well. Yeah, yeah, and I think, um, you know, when you put a player in that position and the player sees that you do trust him, um, uh, that, that has to be a sign of encouragement to him. Um, and, and 
that situation. That was one lady play, you know, and I, again, I thought he, uh, I thought he played very well. Any other update on Al? Uh, no, I have not spoken to Al or any of our doctors yet, uh, uh, but I don't think it's a very serious, uh, you, know, you know, whatever the injury is, I don't think it's serious at all. More so cautionary measure. That wasn't an issue coming in. No, I saw you talking a little bit. Asking if he was okay. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to make sure. Um, when he came out, I think in the first quarter, uh, it might have stiffened up on him. Risk, risk it and put it back in. So. Any thought on that?